It's the largest economic investment in our state's history. Texas Instruments is spending $11 billion to expand in Lehigh, building a semiconductor chip factory. Yes, ABC 4's Courtney Johns joins us live in studio to explain why the company chose Utah, Courtney. Yeah, Emily, the company says Lehigh is the perfect spot for several reasons, including the fact that they already have a good idea of the type of talent they can find right here in Utah after acquiring the company Micron 14 months ago. We got to see the incredible talent with that, that was there, the very you know innovative and creative spirit that they have. We also talked to Ryan Starks with the governor's office of economic opportunity. He says in part the state encouraged vir uh, at one point the state encouraged virtually any company to build in the beehive state, but now they're a little more selective looking for companies that will make a lasting impact. He says Texas Instruments does this adding 800 jobs, most of which will pay six figures. While some states provide upfront cash for a company to set up, Stark says Utah uses economic development tax increment financing, offering tax credits if the company performs both in terms of capital investment and job creation. As they do that, they can then redeem a small percentage of their own taxes that they paid back into the form of a refundable tax credit. And so if they perform, they collect a percentage of their taxes back and if they don't, then they're unable to collect the full amount. So you may be asking yourself, what in the world is a semiconductor chip? Well, TI says it's pretty simple. If you think about anything that has a battery or plugs into a wall, odds are at least one chip is in that item.